Good morning. Um, my name is Irene Jones, and I attended um, Brigitte's uh, seminar this summer. Um, this summer, I created a curriculum geared towards uh, reading comprehension for my fourth grade um, as structured English immersion program. I teach English language learners, and one of the main things that they have trouble with is reading comprehension. And so that's where we begin. I started my unit, and we started uh, by reading the short story by Sherman at Lexi called, this is what it means to say Phoenix, Arizona. We started with that story. And um, we started with storyboard. I had this whole lesson on visualization, and I'll tell them it's like the first part we did together because they were having a hard time understanding what I wanted. So then, um, as we read the story, they did better, and by the end, they kind of did um, everything that they needed to do. And I thought, oh, okay, they understand what we're doing, they understand the story. And so, and then I started, I introduced the storyboard. I did the storyboard and then I introduced um, the screenplay. I decided to do a compare and contrast, but when we read the screenplay and we started comparing, the only thing they could come, come up with was they both had the same characters. That was it. They couldn't really understand what was um, what I wanted, what I mean by compare and contrast. So what they started, one of the girls actually started comparing the format instead of the story itself. So uh, we had to have discussions. It's like, what's different? What's different about this story? What's the same about this story? And we literally went line by line comparing. And it, it was a long process, but we still managed to do it. Um, but um, the thing that I found out was it was the research part that they were having the hardest time with, actually looking for things, actually looking for details, actually looking for information that I want from the story. That's what they were lacking the most, and that's what I found out about um, this curriculum that I created. And so. Right now, we're still doing the compare and contrast. And they're beginning to understand it a little bit better right now. Uh, we, I've had some kids saying, oh, oh, that's what you mean. Oh, I see something else here. And then um, there are still discussions where some of the students are correcting themselves. Like, no, that's not what she means. This is what she means. So they're beginning to discuss the story a little bit better. And um, one of them actually said, this is almost like the movie. Almost, almost like a movie. I was like, yeah, but I haven't introduced the movie yet. So they don't know there's a movie based on what they're reading yet, and which is kind of surprising because it's one of the most viewed movies on the reservation. So I kind of. I'm surprised that they haven't figured out that the story that they're reading and the screenplay that they're reading is actually based, uh, it was made into a movie. So that's where we are at right now with the story or with my curriculum. And hopefully they have a better understanding about how to do reading comprehension and hope oh, we're going to continue building on it. Thank you.